A manhunt is underway in Paris. Police say a lone gunman shot and wounded a photographer at a leading French newspaper on Monday. He's also believed to have opened fire on one of the top banks in France before hijacking a car and disappearing in central Paris. CCTV's Kate Parkinson reports. This is the man police are hunting for. Seen here walking calmly into a French television station last Friday, armed with a pump-action shotgun and threatening staff. Police have released the pictures because they're confident this is the same man who opened fire in a French newspaper office on Monday morning. A man entered the Liberation Building this morning at around 10 o'clock. Without saying anything, he opened fire on a photographer who was shot in the arm and chest. He was taken to hospital and is in critical condition. Police patrols were increased on public transport and a police helicopter was deployed over the centre of the city as the French government vowed to use all means necessary to capture the gunman. As long as this person is still on the loose and we don't know the motives, this represents a threat. We must move fast. Less than two hours after the shooting at Liberation, shots were fired outside the headquarters of Société Générale, France's second biggest bank. An armed man then hijacked a car and forced the driver to drop him close to the Champs-Élysées, Paris's main shopping avenue and then the gunman disappeared. Police are now guarding the Liberation office, as well as other media buildings in Paris, in case of further attacks. Kate Parkinson, CCTV, Paris.